my name is Walter Unglob, and this is the size of an electron compared to an atom and a chromosome. An electron is a tiny fundamental particle of negative charge, and the truth is no one really knows how truly big an electron is. String theory predicts that the size of an electron is on the order of a Planck length, which is approximately 1 times 10 to the negative 35 meters. This is very small. Classically, you can calculate the classical electron radius, which we would denote as R sub e, and the electron radius classically is defined as 1 over 4 pi epsilon naught, where epsilon naught is the permittivity of free space, times the charge of the electron squared, divided by the mass of the electron, times the speed of light squared. So the classical radius, or size of the electron in this case, would be approximately 2.82 times 10 to the negative 15 meters considerably larger than something uh, that string theory would predict. Now we just need to know the approximate sizes of an atom and a chromosome. So one atom has a size on the order of one angstrom, which is equal to 1 times 10 to the negative 10 meters. Whereas a chromosome, while the size can vary just like the size of an atom can vary, but the order of magnitude of an X chromosome is approximately 7 micrometers, or micrometers. This is equal to 7 times 10 to the negative 6 meters. So, if we're interested in comparing the size of an electron to an atom and an X chromosome classically, then we would use the classical radius and for an atom compared to an electron the atom would be 35,500 times larger than the electron whereas the X chromosome would be approximately 2.5 billion times larger than an electron if we're to assume that the electron size is truly on the order of a, pl a Planck length, such as string theory would predict, then an atom would be approximately 1 times 10 to the 25 times larger. That's a 1 with 25 zeros after it. And an X chromosome would be on the order of 1 times 10 to the 30 times larger than an electron. So that's a 1 with 30 zeros trailing after it. So five orders of magnitude larger than an atom. So there is a considerable size difference between these different uh, structures uh, that make up matter and biological systems. My name is Walter Unglob, and this is the size of an electron compared to an atom and a chromosome.